Good afternoon and welcome to Teal House Farm. It is super bright and sunny today. And we are finally getting started on a big project that we have tried to accomplish the last couple of years but have been constantly stopped in our tracks. So if you remember a video a couple weeks ago, I mentioned that Sam was starting again on a big mystery project but that he got stopped because we discovered a ginormous wasp's nest and that's probably about the fourth time we've been stopped when trying to start this project. But it is finally happening and the wasps have been removed. We ended up having to call the professionals. We weren't going to try to do that ourselves because that just sounds like a terrible idea. And we are now tearing apart this awful looking mud room and putting it back together as a functional, usable, safe space. The mud room has been a disaster since we bought the house. It's basically unusable because it gets as wet inside as it does outside every time it rains. We are planning that we are going to need to completely redo it from the foundation up. So if anything is salvageable, it'll be a little bit of money saved. Today is demo day. I personally am very excited. I am so tired of tripping over shoes and coats in my kitchen all the time and having a usable mudroom means that they will get to be out here and stay dry and they won't always be in my way. There's the man of the hour. Oh yeah. So what are your big plans? We're going to tear out the roof of the mudroom. What do you think you're going to find? Uh, I don't know, but it's sure to be thrilling. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is try and clean up all the junk that's in here and just get it out. And then we'll start ripping down the ceiling. We've had water leaking through here for forever. And so, this won't be for the weak stomach, we'll just say, because it's going to be nasty. I don't know what kind of dead animals are going to come out. I don't know what, I mean, there's going to be all kinds of nasty wood and stuff coming out. It's going to be gross, but we're going to... Viewer discretion exactly. advised. Yeah, this, this video needs to come with a warning at the beginning of it, but we're going to try and rip it all out and then see where it puts us. Okay. to get this thing cleaned up. It's been kind of embarrassing for a long time. I'm going to start with the ceiling. I mean, I'm sure there's other stuff that's going to be need to be replaced. But we're going to start with the ceiling, uh, rip all that stuff down, see what kind of repairs need to be made. I know I'm going to have to make some roof repairs, which is, it's been leaking. That's the whole reason why there's issues here. But we're going to start digging and see, see what we find.
they did so many things like mostly right but like the first thing they should have done right they did wrong you can see I know it's hard if I actually actually stand it on the roof you could tell better but they have the flashing there that they ran down and it went whatever that is eight inches short of the actual roof here I don't know why they did that and then you can see where that gap is there's an actual hole where the uh, tar paper they laid some kind of asphalt or something on top of it that's where all the water is coming through so it held up for a while but in the end if you cut it short it's gonna get you Ivy, Daddy is super hot and sweaty. Would you like to make him a Gatorade? I want a Gatorade. I want a Gatorade. You can make. You can have one too. Why? Yay! Why? You don't have to. Mike will do it. Why? Don't, don't you love your daddy? <laughs> Not that much. Who's winning? I already got one. I already won one. Stay, Lexi, stay. Lexi. Lexi. Come here. Inside. Oh, okay. It looks like wider on the outside, but inside Gatorade. Well, that side doesn't look that bad. Uh -uh. Yeah. That side looks terrible. Not too bad. That side looks terrible. That's a little scary. Yeah, I know, right? That side's nice. Basically, the left is kind of okay, and the right is terrible. It's like an oven. Mommy, is it a toy now? Making you happy? It's the sunroof I always wanted. Yeah. And it just kind of comes right down, doesn't it? Kind of. Oh, goodness. Wow, that is a humongous. Uh... They come into our house? Oh, yeah. Just pull in here. Our goat, apparently, has also decided to do some roof repairs. You've got like four acres. Why are you on the roof? Well, that right there is probably the end of day one. We will bring you day two, and once we have a roof on there that doesn't leak like a sieve, we will be able to redo the inside and make it a usable, functional space, which we will also show you what we're doing there. So stay tuned. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.